we ordered the Corsair K70. I'm a bot. <laughs> cherry input. Uh, what do they call it? Low profile. Yeah. Yeah. So, I'm stoked to see it and compare it to what I have. Sounds perfect for Tarkov. Aw, yeah. Okay. So, we're going to open her up real quick. Take a peek at it. See what I like about it. If there's anything I don't like about it, we'll talk about it. Compare it to my non. It's I have the same keyboard right here, the Corsair K70, which I did dry out and it is now working, which is awesome. So we're gonna compare it to the low profile, to the non-low profile. Same keyboard because I didn't. I really didn't want a different keyboard. I like my keyboard. I have nothing. Does it indicate the fast keys type? So, uh, K70, RGB, M MK2, which I believe is just the second model. Rapid fire mechanical keyboard. Uh, it is a low profile RGB speed. The Cherry MX is the, the, the speed of the button. Um, I believe the, um, the, I'm trying to think of the word. Let's see if it's on here. The switch linear action, actuation. That's what I was looking for. The linear actuation for this keyboard is one millimeter. Whereas the one that I have now, the previous version is 1.2 millimeters. I don't think I'll notice a difference, uh, but we will see. I'm super stoked about this guys because I love this keyboard. Um, I love the one that I have. I was really bummed when I spilled coffee on it and it just went out completely. I was really bummed. But I'm also stoked to try the low profile. If I can get this off, here we go. And also, I believe that the grams required to pr actually press down. I'm not sure if it says on here. Um, it doesn't say. However, I believe it is like, I don't know, 0.65 grams. Sounds perfect for Tarkov. Okay, so my previous one had the exact same thing. It has textured keys for ASD and a key remover. That's what this thing is. This thing is a key remover. I believe you press down on the keys and it grabs the key and pull up. And it also has a uh, D, W, E, R, and D, F. I don't know what the specifics of those are, but it's to texture the keys. Um, I didn't use them last time. I don't know that I will on this one. Um, I do particularly like the, I do, I do like these pads for the wrist to lift it up, to give it the rail, to angle your, to rest your wrist on. So far, it's still looking exactly like mine. It's got the braided cord, which I really like. USB 3.0, I believe, two of them. I believe one of them powers a USB plug, which is right here. So one of the USBs powers that USB hub, and the other one plugs in the keyboard, I believe. I could be wrong, but I'm fairly confident. It definitely feels thinner. Other than that, looks very much the same. I see a profile here. My key previous keyboard does not have profiles. So that's pretty nifty. It's got the uh, volume here on the side. Um, I like it. It feels good. It feels quieter. It feels quieter than the previous model. So let's just put it right next to the other one real fast. And we're going to look at the height difference real quick. And we're going to get back to some MX. Yes, it does, Arzy. It does indicate that. And I always like these on the back. Whatever keyboard I'm always using, I always like it tilted up a little bit when I'm using it. 
uh, just for the sake of not having to reach my fingers as far. I'm not sure exactly why. I want to say this is almost identical in height to mine. Which is kind of bonkers. I, maybe my other one was low profile and I didn't realize. It almost seems like it's the same height, which I have no issues with my height. I thought I would try a low profile. I didn't even think of it. Uh, you know, the, the front seems lower, though. Ah, okay. I think I see what's happening. Okay. It is lower. It is lower, which is cool. Um, that it would have been a little bit disappointing. So if you look here, the keyboard is the same height. Like if I run my finger across, it's the same height here. However, if you go to the height of the keys, that's where it's low profile. These are like more recessed into the keyboard where these stand out higher. So that's pretty cool. Um, we're going to see how this feels on my hand versus what I'm used to. But these definitely sit a lot lower. So that's pretty cool. I like it. I like it. So this is the Cor Corsair Low Profile MX K70 uh, Cherry MX Speed. And uh, I really liked the previous Corsair that I own, the, this, this Corsair. I've had it for about three years. Um, one thing I like about the frames is they're aluminum. They're really, they're really tough. Uh, the keys come off nicely. It's easy to clean. Um, and it's obviously stood up to a couple of spills that I had. So, highly recommend these keyboards. I do recommend them. So, that is the unboxing of the K70. MK2 low profile. I like it, dude. MK2 low profile. Cherry MX. Chat, thank you for getting it for me, guys. I appreciate you guys sending it. You guys are the best. And, uh, yeah. Thank you very much.